everybody welcome to country girl today i have another dollar tree haul for you um, i did pick up a lot of hair um, accessories this trip they had a lot of scuncy products and i was really surprised at all of the cute things that they had so i am going to go over those first and then i will show you in the end some of the other items that i picked up the first thing that I picked up that I found that I thought was really cute are these little snap clips. Now these aren't by Scuncy, these are Greenbrier, but I just thought those were really cute. Um, they come in like the silver, black, and gold, and they're not like overly shiny. They're more of a matte look to them, and so I picked those up, and then I also picked up a set like this. These are kind of like little flattened type hearts, and then the other set that I got... Um, as hearts as well but they are a different design and just to show you what they look like um, side by side and the difference of them but i thought those were really cute my girls like to wear those little top knots or messy buns and sometimes they have like little flyaway hair in the back and i just thought this might be cute for them to use versus a bobby pin you know to give them a little bit more style or whatever so i did get those of course all of these i got um, for my girls because i don't have enough hair to do that and this is themed i think more for like younger type people um, this one is a the double hair band now this is by scuncy and it's one band but it does give you the double band look and if the back of this is kind of like the stretchy and it's like satin here but then the top part that you go on is kind of like a rubber and on the inside of it i don't know if you can tell but it actually has I'm trying to flip this out like a little rubber piece here so that it stays on your hair and i don't think the way it feels that it would be something that would actually pull your hair it just helps to stay in your hair so that um you know it doesn't go anywhere so i thought that was a really good find um you know for a dollar I also got um, these headbands. This is um, kind of like a sport type headband. And it makes me feel, uh, think of like the t-shirt material and how it feels because it's really soft. And also on the inside, it does have those little rubber um, pieces to kind of help hold it onto the hair. But I did get this in gray. And then the other one that I picked up is the same, only it's like more of a raspberry type color. So I picked those two up, and they do like to wear these, you know, with their buns or ponytails or whatever. And then I also picked up these. I thought these were really cute. These are just kind of like little hair scrunchies. Um, you get two in a pack. One is red, and then this one is the blue with the polka dots. This one actually has like a little bow on it. And if you can see the girl in the picture, how she's got her hair up with a little bun, and then she has the bow on the front. I just thought that was really cute, and um, so I did pick up that. And then I picked up another one. It's just a different color. This one is more of a coral color, and then this one's kind of like gray. I thought that might go with a few more things, so I did get that. And they can just, you know, share those or whatever. And then I also was looking for some, like, hair barrettes, but I was really mainly looking for the really big ones because Madeline's been wanting to, like, pull her hair back. And she was using, like, one of those little claw clips, and those don't always do such a great job. I couldn't find any, but I did find, like, the smaller um, little hair barrettes, and these have those really nice clasps in the back, so they stay really well. The only thing is, um, you know, you can't put a whole lot of hair in these. But I did pick these up and thought, you know, she could try those out. And then that's all of the hair products that I got. Um, while I was in, like, the beauty section, I did find some of this um, LA Colors Lip Topper. It's called Cosmic and this one is in um it says lunar it's more like a silver and you can see that's the regular lipstick and then that's what it's supposed to look like when you put it over top of it they did also have a gold one but i just went ahead and went with the silver to give it a try and see how that does um if i remember to do that at the end of this haul i'll put some over my lipstick i've got on now and let y'all see what that looks like I also picked up some band-aids. I really like these band-aids. Um, I use these for work. I have a little office supply kit that I keep at work. And, um, you know, that we get a lot of paper cuts and stuff. So, anyway, I do keep these on hand all the time. And I really like these because these are fabric bandages. And they're just a really nice band-aid to have. So, I picked up some more of those. I also picked up a fingernail file, and I have said in the past I didn't really care for their fingernail files, and I think it really depends on what it is or the type that you get, because I did have this one in my um, nail box at home, and this one actually is a really nice one, and I think maybe because it's just more of abrasive, 
Um, seems like the ones that has the little patterns and stuff on them are the ones that I feel like are more cheaply made. But I did pick up one of these because this is a really nice um, abrasive fingernail file to have, especially if you have like, you know, fake nails or something like that or, you know, tougher, thicker nails. And then um, I picked up some more wipes. I always like to keep the wet wipes um, in my car. And I usually get the red pack. I'm sure you know what I'm talking about, but they didn't have any at this particular Dollar Tree. So I did get these. These are wet wipes as well. It says personal care, but this one um, also says that it's antibacterial. And I was reading somewhere where it says something about killing 99% germs. But anyway, um, this one actually has like, it says refreshing waterfall is the scent. And you get 10 more in here than you do in the other pack. I think the other pack, you only get 30 wipes. So I did, you know go ahead and pick this up thought i'd give this a try now i don't know if these are thicker thinner whatever let me just go ahead and open it up i'm talking to you so we'll see they do have a different smell i can't really say it's a great smell but i'm pulling this out this wipe um it's pretty good um you know about the same size i would say so anyway i'm gonna tuck these back in here i do still think i prefer the other ones just because this smell isn't um i don't know it almost makes me think of a cleaning product you know kind of like something you would put in your mop water like i said it's not a bad smell um it's just i don't know how to explain it anyway I'm going to be using those until those are all gone, and then I'll replace those with the red ones later on down the road. Um, I also picked up some soft soap, which I think this has been leaking because there's some on the outside of it. Good thing I got my wipes, huh? can use that to clean this up for you, so I'm not showing you a dirty product here. But they usually always have some kind of soft soap. This one is fresh, fresh lemon and mint. And I do like to have, um, you know, I do like to put like fruity type smells, mints, things like that, lemons in my kitchen. So I did buy this to go on my kitchen counter. Just to let you know that Walmart is actually putting out their little holiday um, soft soap editions. And you can get them with, you know, like Santa Claus on it, a snowman, a little elf, things like that. And um, yeah, so if you want one that has a little holiday images on it, you do want to head to Walmart to get that. But I did pick up some of this soft soap. When I was going through their food section, I saw this um, apple and cranberry tea. Now, I've had a lot of people tell me this is really good tea. And being that, you know, we are in fall season, the apple and cranberry just kind of jumped out to me. I'm not a big tea drinker, but I will drink it occasionally. And I just thought that maybe this would be something nice to carry to work, maybe in the afternoons, um, have some and see how that is. Um, this is a black tea. So anyway, if y'all have tried this out before, let me know what you thought of that. I also um, was in the craft section where they have like the wreaths and stuff like that and i saw these new bird decorations that they've got out and they always had some kind of birds but i haven't ever seen any quite this pretty this is a cardinal and this is the north carolina state bird but i always like the cardinal for winter time just because the red i just think looks so so beautiful in the snow and so i got this i thought this would be really pretty you could actually clip this onto a christmas tree branch you could clip this onto a wreath a table centerpiece anything and you know you can see the clip behind it so um anyway and this is like a velvet type material i just thought that was really pretty they also had i think some finches um the little yellow and black birds as well but i did get that and then um I was in the pet section and my dog Shasta she is a very little chihuahua but if you get near her while she's eating she will like run off and I think what it is is because the bowls that I currently have her eating out of are really deep and when she puts her little head down into those bowls she can't see what's going on around her so I decided I was going to get her some smaller bowls now these are advertised as like cat bowls or cat dishes but I think this is really probably a better size for her so I did get two of those. This does have like a rubber ring around it um, so that it will not slide. And you can take those off if you need to, um, you know, to wash your bowl. So I did get two of those. 
And then while I was in the um, housewares or kitchenware section, I actually was able to find the bamboo cutting boards. <laughs> they finally got these at my Dollar Tree, so I did go ahead and pick up four of these. I don't really have any plans for them, but I know that there's a ton of DIYs out there using these boards so i may do that or i may just save them until i can come up with one of my own but i did get four of those and i was super excited to see those in my dollar tree and while i was there i also picked up some more storage bags um, i did get this one this is the extra extra large storage bag and it basically just it's got the handle on it but it just zips like a big ziploc bag so I did get that. You do get one in here. And then I got the two extra large bags. Now this is the size that I had got that I had hauled a while back um, that I used to put the uh, my birthday bags and stuff like gift bags and stuff like that in. Somebody had commented that that's what they did with theirs. And so I decided to do it too. And it works out really well. You can get a lot of gift bags in those little bags. And um, you know, you could even buy several of them and sort them out, put birthday in one, Christmas in one, and so on. And because they've got these little handles on them, you could probably even hang these up, um, you know, somewhere in your closet if you wanted to do that. So I did get two um, boxes so that I could have those. Um, also, what really made me think about getting these was um, we try and keep our Halloween costumes because you never know when you're going to need them for another year. And these would be really good to put Halloween costumes in if you don't keep the original packaging, which most of the time isn't very good anyway, or if you make your own costume. So that's what I'm going to do also with these is I'm going to put, you know, a couple Halloween costumes in here and I can actually hang these over a hanger and put them in my foyer closet for, you know, if we ever need them for anything else. And also while I was there, I went ahead and picked up some more of these little containers here. I did haul these in one of my other hauls. And I think the last one I had got had the little red truck and the snowman. But I really like this little um, gingerbread set here. So I went ahead and bought two of those. And I'm not sure. I'm probably going to keep the little red truck one to, for myself. But I may fill these up with other things and gift these out this year for Christmas. I haven't really decided what I'm going to be doing with my Christmas gifts yet. Even if it has a gingerbread man on it, I probably am going to put some kind of baked goods in it. But those do stack for those of you who have not seen the other Dollar Tree haul that I did. Um, and they have a rubber ring around the lid. So, you know, it keeps it, you know, sealed up and fresh for some time probably not as good as other containers but you know you can keep them for long enough i don't think if you put baked goods in here i don't think anybody's going to leave them around very long anyway and then while i was there i also was looking at the wrapping paper now normally when it comes to wrapping paper i like to get my wrapping paper at tj maxx or marshall's just because their wrapping paper is so thick and you get so much on a roll for like three to five dollars i can't really remember how much they charge but it is so worth it but I was there and I was looking to see if anything jumped out at me and I did find one that I thought was just really adorable and so I did pick this up and I really liked it. I thought the little penguin on here was really cute. I think the Santa Claus on here is really whimsical. I really like how his beard looks kind of like you can see the little curls in it and you know it's just got like snow, Merry Christmas, and a little um you know christmas ornaments things like that so i probably will be using this wrapping paper for the kids gifts um you know when i do those this year so i got that and this is one of them really long you know <laughs> rolls of wrapping paper and this is um, 30 square feet so this would be something nice to wrap really large boxes or gifts with as well and then lastly um i was able to find they're putting out their window clings um and I just got, because I don't really need window clings, I got the one that I just absolutely could not resist. And so that is this one here. And this is so cute. I could not, not get this. And the little bear and the penguin, all the white on here, even the Santa Claus beard and the snowflakes um, are kind of like a glitter type, but it's not um, any kind of glitter that will have any fallout whatsoever. I mean, this stuff is not coming off. It's just you can feel it on here and um, you can kind of see it if you turn the, the light the right way. But I thought that was so cute. Of course, there's glitter on the tree here. You've got the little fox. And then, you know, Santa in his buffalo check 
<laughs> outfit and the buffalo check bow here on the wreath too cute and the little gingerbread girl she's got her buffalo check on too so they're really incorporating that in here it just makes me think of a little country christmas scene so i did get that and then the other window clings that they have these are a little bit different these are more like stickers and versus the clings but i like to get these because i like to use these as stickers for scrapbooking and so i thought this was a really pretty set here it's got the um little nutcracker a little gingerbreads and santa claus so i got that set and then i got this one here and you've got your camper all decked out for christmas your little red truck with your snowman or snowman and then your christmas tree um, what I like to, um, they've got the silver around it. I don't really like a lot of these iridescent type stickers, but they put it on the edge so that it's not actually interfering with the image itself. But I did get those. Okay, so I did say that I was going to try out this lipstick here. So I'm going to see what this does. I'm going to open this up. Hopefully it'll be pretty sheer. Without any overpowering. So just to kind of see you let you see what that looks like. I actually like it. It's very sheer. It's not like really thick. So it doesn't like uh, cover up your color. So I actually may go back and get me some of the gold if I can find it. But it's, you know, LA Colors Cosmic Lip Topper. So that's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.